Speaking of middle distance, we uh, start off with the men's 800 metres, and we have a man in this field who set the world record back in 2010. That is David Rudisha. He has the world record, which he's improved, of course. Rudisha also taking the Olympic title just recently, just a couple of weeks ago. There he is, David Likuta Rudisha. The tall Kenyan with the lanky strides and the, the lungs that just provide those muscles with all the oxygen they need. It's also the uh, European champion is in the field, Adam Gestad of Poland. Som there is the pacemaker for the first lap of this man's two lap race, of course. David Radisha, I remember a story about him winning an event a few years back, and I think he bought a cow for everyone in his local village. So Ludov is on the inside. Soren Ludov, German athlete. 146 43 this season. A couple of seconds off his uh, personal best there. He's the only German athlete in the, in the race. Kivier gone bets. One of a handful of Kenyans. And you see, he too will won a sub-145 runner. Jackson Kivuva. Born 89. PB 143.72. Only ninth in the world champs last year, though. Tarbay, Willie Tarbay. Another so much quality in Kenyan middle distance. A Frenchman, Samir Dalani. His uh, biggest accomplishment to date uh, took place in the World Juniors back in 2010. Lewandowski, second in the European Championships behind his countryman, Gustav who is sporting a new haircut. I see in very good form this season. David Rudisha. That PB is the world record. That season's best is the winning time from the Rio Olympic Games over the distance. He oozes calm, does David Rudisha. And Brown Song. Earning a bit of extra cash for running just a one lap in this one. So Radisha hoping for the pace to be set by Som. Unlike at the Olympics where they do not have a hair in the race. There is no pace setter, of course, and times can often be slower. But they're away in the men's 800 meters here at the 75th edition of the East Half Berlin as World Challenge event. The long strides of Radisha coming towards the front of the field. Bet there too. And there he is in behind Som. Really is a flying sprint of endurance this race. They say the 400 meters is very tough, but if you can ever get down to the track and see how quickly these gentlemen and the ladies in the 800 meters are moving for two laps of the track. Of course, the bell rings, one lap to go. Som is going to go around the bend and then he'll cruise off. On the other side of that one, Radisha. He does have a fluid, fluid style. Bent is looking to attack him on the back straight as Som's pushing wide. Radisha, little look over his shoulder. He tensed up a little bit. And away Radisha goes. We could have a uh, flying time on our hands here if they can keep this pace up. He's not going to let Bent get the better of him. That's for sure. David Radisha pushing around the band. The rest of the field are fighting for third. And that group of five people. 
Campbell. That is pushing very hard. He's pushing David Radisha all the way as the clock strikes 136, 137. What are we going to see for a time here, ladies and gentlemen? Just outside the season's best, but 143. 31 for David Radisha and that believe it or not is just his second victory here in Berlin of course uh, setting the world record gave him the victory in 2010 I remember the, that one very well in this famous blue track so yet another victory for David Radisha and he's got the uh, two of the fastest four times of the year the Olympic gold and another Easter Berlin title and to check who uh, managed to sneak in for third out of the rest the best of the rest Christoph looks like he might have got it there with a good finish let's have a look yes indeed the European double European champion, the man third over the line, and no doubt about the winner. Bert, he tried to give it a go, he really did push, but it wasn't enough to try and threaten David Rudisha. Already up to the final 300 meters, Bert was attacking. Rudisha reacted immediately, and there's that smile the broad smile of Kenya's David Rudisha very happy man in the foreground uh, javelin of course is under